Ah! God, this game is ass sometimes. This is big ass. Can you fucking believe this? I need to get rid of that archer very quickly. Oh, these mages fare against her. Not that good. So can you? No. Alright, let's do this. Everything's planned. What do you have here? Killing Edge? <laughs> How do you fare against the mages? They do hurt. They really hurt. But I, the archer needs to die. I trust you, Cormac. Yeah, I trust you. I trust you, my boy. Not sure if they can arrive. They can. Ah, all right. Let's bring him here so we're not in range of the shaman in the north. I, I guess. Uh, definitely don't want to. At all. Okay, let's. <sighs> if I miss, I'm fucked. What if? Okay, what if... no. So how much damage do they do? 14 and 13. 4, 2 resistance. So it's 12 plus... not enough, good. So I don't have to restun her, pretty much. I'm just gonna put her here and just heal her up. Just advance, I guess. Then everyone can retaliate with their distance weapons and... That's pretty much it. Good. Alright. Go Kyle! Yes! That extra speed you got is awesome! <coughs> Kyle will be visiting the shop. And meanwhile Seth will be visiting this and we will get Ewan finally. Uh, hello, my name's Ewan and I'm training to be, to be a sage. I need to find a woman by the name of Marissa. I don't know where she's gone. If you help me find her, I'll gladly travel with you. I'm a useful guy you to know. In a pinch, I can use the magic I've learned so far. So what do you say? We have a deal? Yes. And here's Ewan, we already explained about him last uh, part. He comes with the Draco shield, which is nice. I'll have to be careful not to lose him, because Ewan dies very quickly. Now here comes the reinforcements, all of them. Nice crate. Yes. Gilliam doesn't give a fuck about you. Pretty me again. Ah, oh, I was hoping he would do that. <laughs> hmm. Nice. Oh man. Everything's going so well now. Is fortune smiling upon me finally? Oh, my dear. Oh. Nice, look at this, look at fucking this. <coughs> I can finally use Stan as a mage healer, even though I have to use a pure water to get rid of the shaman before, but that's fine. Level 8. HP, lock. God damn defense. Yes! Yes! Oh! Oh! Baby! That's fucking right. Now how many turns do we have of uh, reinforcements? There's going to be quite a, quite a lot. Uh, two turns of reinforcements at least, right? Well that's fine. I will attract at least one of these champ- I don't have a javelin, never mind. What do you guys have? It's iron swords, iron lance. I guess I'll put Cormac here so he can deal with them as well. And just I'll start moving from the other side since uh, we're going to be stopping here, dealing with these guys. So meanwhile, I can move units 
on the other side. So we can attack from a different angle. And now the thing is to rescue her somehow. Well, I do know how, but... I put him here with a jab, and I guess I'm bringing Seth to the town, since we already have uh, something to do with Kyle. Can I enter here? There's something here, right? Ah, I wonder if a dancer will ever come this way again. I don't know why, but her dance has really pe pepped me up. Oh, really? She should have been a very beautiful dancer. <laughs> she Even after a high day as well, I felt fresh and I'd just woken up. It should be nice to see her dance for me again someday. Oh, yeah. Get those lab dancers, dude. Uh, let's put some other units close. Um, who needs healing? Who needs healing? Hello. Maybe Ross will heal him just because it's nice to feed Mulder some more experience. Nice. Pretty close to all. Transforms himself. Anyways, uh, this is working as planned. Mm. Very good job, Cormac. Total bro. Nice! Probably bee lancers now. Did I attract some of the shamans? I really want to do that, but I didn't. Alright. So getting rid of these archers is fantastic. Didn't hit. Uh, I, I didn't miss, which is nice. I appreciate that. Anyways, how can I attract one of these? I guess I'll do this. Yeah. If I can attract with loot as well, I'll do it. I'll put her here. What? What? Ah! Not even fair. Is this a normal forest? This is actually a normal forest. Wow. Alright, let's visit the shop. Like I want it. Oh my one fire. It's good. One thunder. It's good. Uh, one shine, I guess. I did buy one with the other thing, so why not? One heal. That's pretty much it. I'm already done with this. Good! So this is normal forest. Actually, you can pass th from here, which is alright. See him dance. Or lance. Advance through here. Oh, I guess I'm clicking the keyboard a little bit too loud. Sorry about that. Hopefully that was not... Something that bothered you. Uh, level 14 for Mulder, magic and skill. Yes, magic! Alright. This is what I like. <coughs> More skellymans, come that other way. Ouch. God, these guys are tough. For Tan, at least. But she's dealing well with them. Alright, no problem. So I'm just waiting for that, for one of those shamans to start moving. I need to attract them. One of them, I think, had like a guiding ring, if I remember correctly. Level 14, H fucking B. Ugh. Yes, here comes one. I thought it was stealable in the beginning, but I guess it's not. Alright. We're gonna give some extra experience to Efri Eden. And he's gotta level up as well. He's level 16, HP, strength, speed, luck. Quite excellent as always. What you can expect from him. Um, if, if I can attract the two of them, that'd be even better. But I wouldn't like to heal. But I don't think I'll be able to. So you have 16 and 8. What? Oh, Luna. Okay. 
Nah, I'll, I'll, yeah, I'll do this. Yeah, I'll do this. And then kill this guy. He has no chance to crit me, so he's just safe to get these experience to tan as well. Great! And I can just heal her up. Easily peasily. Hmm. <laughs> Ah, yes. And let's equip some sort of hand axes and weaponry that's able to allow me to deal with my enemies easily. I really don't need to advance more than this. Alright, so you wait here with that lance. Bring Seth back. And loot back, I guess. I guess I just can help here with her. No problem with that. I'm just thinking how to attract uh, Marisa. Maybe I should do it from this side, but I wanted to do it with uh, Gilliam, since she since he's not going to take damage from her. Well, I'll see how I'll do it. <coughs> oh, Kyle doubling! Is this a dream? Is this actually a dream? <laughs> What's going on? Ah, here comes this dude. Thinks he's funny. Oh, I guess he can survive. That's why he did it. But that's cool. I can give the experience to someone else, like Tana or Calm, if I can. Alright, here comes the other one. It's starting to hurt a bit. Oh! Alright, good. And a level up for Gilliam as well. Level 15, HP, Strength, Luck and Resistance. Now, if that isn't cool, you tell me. Best character in the game. I could give experience to E1, but uh, honestly, I don't feel like using him now. I might use him in the Valny Tower while, while I do that after we beat the game. Because I'm planning on doing that, yeah. Alright. I'll retreat. I kill you with this. Yes. <coughs> Good G. Or J. From Job. And that will be a kill. <clears throat> All right, here we go. Level nine. Ah! He does fifteen. Oh no, definitely, definitely not messing around with that thing. Oh, well, he does three damage. She only does three damage. Just they have the same reach, which sucks. I knew it one in the north. Yeah. Yeah, I need him. No one can attack through the wall. I think. There we go. I'll do them with them. I'll trust them. God, this is probably not a good idea, but. Uh, I already started doing it, so I can't stop now. I'm turtling a bit, I noticed. That's fine. Okay, here we go. Luna, dude. Fine. Seven creed. 24 damage, not enough to kill me even if he crits, so that's perfect. <sighs> he did hit me too as well. Fucking sucks. Alright. Bring him here. Even close. And I don't fucking know what to do now. I guess loot is nice to have around. <laughs> okay. We can finally get rid of this guy. Um, I would like to do it with someone that will not kill him first and then kill him with another one. Um, try to raise a level. Call me. Yes. No crit. <laughs> 
Don't quit him. There we go. <coughs> <sighs> My man. This is just complicated. Alright. 100% accuracy. Not sure if the boss move. I don't recall the boost. The boss moving. Uh, level up for calm. As anticipated. Level 13. HP. Speed and defense. Gladly take that defense. Although the level up was kind of shitty. And the guiding ring. Good. Oh, this is so nice. It's actually super nice. Alright. I like this. A lot. Okay. I like this. I like where this is going. Cormac is still good enough to take damage. Because it's quite defensively powerful. Right? And Seth has reinforcements, let's go! Alright, here he comes! 14 damage! Oh! That is intense, but he's dead now. Yeah. <laughs> That's what you get for messing with Garcia. God! Alright. No problem. I think this is coming into a nice fruition. We dealt with our opponents quite easily, but uh, still not satisfied. Or satisfied enough, that is. Alright, everyone close. We want to attract uh, this guy now. We'll do it with Cormag. After healing him, of course. And meanwhile, I want to attract this guy as well. I'll do it with uh, Lord Ephraim of. Uh, Farai, it's not Farai. Alright, wait here. You wait here. You heal Cormag, because it's important to have him healed. And now the risky parts of the of this business are happening. Let's see if we can get the experience to Tana or Calm. Alright, good. Here it comes! This dude's going to be hitting pretty fucking hard. Uh, and he hits, damn it. <coughs> they always hit, dude. Nice damage, though. So, these guys give a full level of experience, so it would be... Okay, yeah, zero damage, good. No crits, too. Oh. I do have a problem with E1, though. Hmm. Well, no. I think I got it. Yeah, let's do this. Talk to to Marisa. There we go. Here you are, Marisa. Ewan? What are you doing here? Marisa, the mercenary guild sent me here. Sent you here, didn't they? They sent you to fight under Commander Garrick. That's right. But Chief's not here. I know. It was all a mistake. Your commander's over there. Walking on another job. He wants you to join him. Really? He said that? Yep. I'm on my way. Hey, wait, wait, take me with you. This group's headed at east too. Let's stick with them for now. Very well. <laughs> yeah, Marisa is not a not a lady with too much words, but uh, now we have to be careful with this guy, which is five movement. He he can't really seem to reach. So I'm out of here, right? Yeah. And. Loot comes here and saves the day! <coughs> Alright. Okay. Nice experience for her too. So she's a level 15. HP and skill. No fucking magic. Why? <laughs> what are you doing this? Uh, he can attack uh, loot, but I think she'll be definitely fine. 
Well, I can just... He... <sighs> hand axe. I definitely want that. I don't want the hand axe, to be honest. How much am I dust for me? 11. I'll be fine. Let's get rid of him. Man, Cormac has been amazing. So what I was saying before is that we need to kill the zombie with uh, probably a unit that's very hard to get a level with. Because they give you a full level of experience. Like probably Garcia or Seth are good candidates to do that. Meanwhile though, I can get some extra damage here. Yes. There we go. There we go. Nice! Oh. Just a bit. And then I'll think what to, uh, what to give the experience to. Maybe Seth. He hasn't been participating that much. Well, he did quite well, but it's nice to give him a full level of experience to him. <coughs> As you can see. Full level. What? I thought it was a full level up. I would have given that to Garcia then. Should have known. Should have known. Who's about to level up? 26, 26, 51, 70. I like Ross for this. <laughs> Fuck your weapon triangle. <laughs> ah, level 10, HP and speed. Yes. So it's time for the heals and time to slay the huge monster. The first time actually we've seen Cyclopses in this adventure, as you can see, look at him. That's a Cyclops. Looking quite strong. Really want to give me that Sword Slayer, so he has to have that axe equipped. It's a shame that they didn't count these Cyclops as armored units. That would have been pretty funny. I mean, they're very bulky anyway, so why not? And you can imagine uh, Cyclops has a very thick skin. Look at them. Aren't they fucking awesome? I love them. 61 HP too. <laughs> okay. Well, I think it's time for Joshua to intervene. And get some crits. And we have to kill him this turn too. Hmm. That's not that much damage. I thought it would have... Yeah, they're very bulky, as I said. Let's see what, uh, what you can do. That's a bit better. Very nice. I'm just hoping you don't get a crit, so I want to get these killed to someone else. Great. Only 13 HP left. <laughs> I don't think you can even hurt him. Nope. What about the steel sword? Nope. <laughs> He's a bit far away. Okay. Extra damage. Very good. Is this Garcia time? This might be Garcia time. Oh yeah. Yes. Can I get extra damage without killing you? Indeed. Gotta love to get as much experience to everyone as I can. <laughs> okay. Let's go, Gillium, with the, your last Iron Axe. Excellent. No quote from the monster, of course. Look at that. One level up. He's very close. Level 19. HP, Strength, Skill, Luck, Defense. Yes! Oh, that was satisfying, was it? I got the Sword Slayer as well. Beautiful. <coughs> Victory! The enemy troops have been defeated. We're, we're taking care of the wounded now. Understood. We'll rest in this city until we're prepared to advance. Replenish the supplies and rest the troops. Remind every soldier that every anyone breaks the city's laws will be severely punished. Anything else? We should prepare defenses along the east castle of assault. The capital's not far. Fresh troops will be here at any time. Good point. Alright. Start the rotating watches. Then... And yeah, pretty much this. Meanwhile, Mir thinks about life. Pardon me, African. Did she just fucking left? Where's gone? Are you sure? Yes, yeah, she's been missing since this morning. There are no signs of a struggle. I feel she left her on her own account. Where did she go? Did no one see her? 
One of our guards reports having seen the young lady heading east. She said she seems unsteady on her feet. May have been her. Prepare to move out. We head east. Prince Ephraim. I'm not just acting on emotion, Seth. The capital lies in the east as well. Seth, you will obey my... Your commander and sovereign, do you hear me? Listen, I know what you said is true, but I am king in all but title now. I know I must place my duty as a commander of my life as a man. And once I'm crowned, I most certainly will do exactly that. However, I'm not ready to divorce myself from my compassion just yet. I'll find myself balanced somehow. A means to save my country and her people. That is the king I wish to become. And so, that is the man I must be. I need your help in this, Seth. I understand, Persephone. If that's your decision, then I'll do my best to assist you. I'm counting on it. Please be safe, Mir. Be safe, be safe. Okay! Wow, that gave me some fucking problems, dude. The RNG was not in my side at the beginning, but then everything came to fruition, which is nice. Whew. Anyway, anyways, thank you guys for watching. That was very enjoyable to do. And, you know, I had fun, actually. Well, I did suffer, but I had fun, actually. But uh, <laughs> I'll see you guys next time. We'll do chapter 13, the Hamiel Canyon with Erica's route. And oh boy, that chapter is quite interesting. We'll be having some trouble. I'm pretty sure we will. Thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.